Hey guys, Targo Cyclone FPV, and I'm doing a real quick video here on, uh, I've put in some tutorials of mine where I'm using a 64 gig stick or a memory stick SD card to put into the Tyrannus controllers. And I put a little tutorial on how to make the 64 gig go down to 16 so that it can be read in the transmitters. Uh, instead of adding that to every video, I'm just gonna make this one video and that way I'm gonna put links on it so that you guys can watch this part and it doesn't have to be done every time, okay? So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to share my screen with you here. Uh, Bear with me a second here. Uh, let's do that. Okay. So from here, what we're going to do is we're actually going to go right click. We're going to right click on the Windows icon and left click on run. And we're going to type the word control. Once you type in control, hit OK. All right. And then from there, I'm going to open this screen big so we can see what we're doing here. All right. Now, at the same time, I'm going to go ahead and take my memory stick here and insert it into the computer. All right. Now, I'm going to do that through a USB card reader. But whatever ways you have to read your memory stick, just go ahead and get it ready by putting it into the computer. And you'll see, you'll hear the computer make a noise here in just a second. All right. Okay, there we go. Let me turn the volume up. I know we barely heard that. All right. Then it's going to open the folder contents up for me. Okay, so now let me just increase my volume. There we go. All right. So you can close that folder contents there. And what you want to do is you want to go ahead and go to administrative tools. And from administrative tools, you're going to go to computer management and double click on that. And when that opens up, you want to go to disk management, this thing right here. All right. Now, once you go to disk management, give it a second. It's going to refine it again. Okay. So under disk management, and I'd already done this on this one, but I'm going to go ahead and uh, no matter what you see in here, I want you to go ahead and find the part that has the letter on it, right? So we're going to look for the removable disk and you're going to find the part that has a letter. So in this case, it's D. Right click on that part and left click on uh, delete volume and just click yes. And what's going to end up happening is that entire thing is going to get cleared out. And now you're going to have one big partition here or not a partition uh, with a black line on it or a black cover on it. You see when it's done properly, you have blue and when it's not, you have black. So you want to go ahead now and right click on anywhere in this box right here that says unallocated and then go ahead and click left click on simple volume, new simple volume. And then you're going to get this wizard that pops up. And if the wizard delays, you can click it again. It usually sometimes it takes me twice to do it. But in either case, here's the simple volume wizard. Click next. And then right here is your size change. Just type 16,000. Uh, there we go. Just like that. 16000 and click next. And then you can allow it to sign the drive letter, so just click next. And then right here, you want to format the volume. You want to make sure the file system is FAT32. You can leave the volume the, the volume label the way it is and the allocation unit size, uh, leave it as default. So these three things can be like this. And then make sure you have a check mark here and perform quick format and click next. And then click finish. Now what it's going to do is it's going to automatically quick format this partition to make it 16 gig or close to 16 gigs. And that point, you're good to go. So now it just reopen as volume E. And if you look right here, you have 15.63 uh, gigs of space. So now you're done, right? Now this can go and you could go into the tutorials and use these SD cards uh, to, um, to put your uh, FreeSky data on. And the reason, again, that we did this is I bought a bunch of 64 gig sticks that were cheap, right? Really cheap, uh, but they could be read, so we had to partition it down. So anyways, there you go, guys. Um, I hope that helps. It's, this is what you can use now when you go do the FreeSky tutorials that we offer at Cyclone FPV's website. website. If you have any questions, please always uh, go to our website, go to our contact page, and then hit me up here. And then as always, please follow us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel until I ask. And I know the biggest complaint is that I talk really fast. But here's the deal. You can pause, click, rewind, do whatever you want to do. I try to get this done as quickly as I can for people. And that's about it. So God bless. Be safe. Enjoy time with your family. You never know how much time you have left. So please make the most of it. And as always, peace.